Hi, today I am going to go for the sensory learning pack or Inside the Big Top. This topic on the circus contains nine lessons. But before we start, we love to see your photos of your home learning here at school. So if you have any amazing photos we, you want to share, please do send them to your teacher on WeDuck or by the office email, office at ellesmere.leicester.sch.uk. Okay, let's go for the lesson plans. Lesson one is all about popcorn play. You will need a big container or box filled with popcorn using different items from around the kitchen. Can you scoop, squash or pour the popcorn? These could be spoons, cups or jugs, anything you can find. An adult will need to use keywords such as full, empty, more, less, pour to support your learning. Lesson two is about a clown face handprint. Choose the colour paint you want to do and paint your hands. You might need a ha an adult's help with this, the paint with a paintbrush. Press your hand hard onto a piece of paper and after it is dried, you can draw the eyes and the nose and the ears. Lesson three is about elephant water play, where elephants squirt the water out of their trunks. Using a spray gun or water bottle filled with water, spray other people directly onto their skin to see what it feels like. Let them do it to you too. Probably best to do this one outside. Lesson four is about carnival writing. For this, you will need a tray or plate, coloured sprinkles or lentils, paper and a comb. Have an adult write large numbers or letters on a piece of paper. Place that piece of paper in the tray or on the plate. Then sprinkle over it the red lentils or the sprinkles. Using your fingers or an ice cream cone, can you trace over the numbers or the letters that they've written? Can you make any marks yourself or maybe even any shapes? Lesson five is puffy paint candy floss. This puffy paint looks just like candy floss and is really fun to paint with. You can make an edible or non-edible version, depending on what you think is more suitable. You will need different ingredients depending on which one you want to make, which are listed here in the learning pack. Mix all the ingredients together, then roll out a big piece of paper. Roll it into a cone shape and stick it together. Stick the cone onto a bigger piece of paper and paint the ice cream on top using your candy floss paint. Lesson six is about turning ice cream into clowns by going upside down. Put a scoop of ice cream into a cupcake case and stick an upside down cone on as a hat. Decorate it with sweeties. You could decorate it with much sweeties as you want or you might want to decorate some as ears, mouth, nose and eyes. Lesson seven is about exploring different textures that we would see at the circus that are also around your house. Go around your house to try out different textures that you can find. They can be woolly jumpers, sponges or silk scarves. Play some circus music on YouTube and dance around with the different textures. What do they feel like? Lesson eight is a popcorn bucket, but the popcorn hasn't popped. Fill a large bowl or, or box with uncooked popcorn, they're called kernels. Include a small container and some cotton wool balls. Using kitchen tongs or tweezers, move the cotton balls from the large container into the small one. You could also practice scooping up the unco uncooked popcorn with a spoon to practice your fine motor skills. The final lesson is all about playing with Play-Doh on circus mats. The learning pack contains recipes for an edible Play-Doh and a non-edible Play-Doh, whichever is more suitable. Choose which one you want to make, mix all the ingredients together to make a firm Play-Doh. Then use the Play-Doh to make balloons on the circus Play-Doh mats. Have lots of fun playing with all the different things that you're going to be learning about with the circus. And please do send us any photos of any of your learning to us at school.